Hello world, in today's video I'm going to show you how to install pip. So the first thing we want to do is test that our python is installed by opening a command prompt and typing python. We can see that it's installed fine, so I'm now going to exit uh, that, so you just type exit open bracket close bracket and uh, that will exit that out of python. Give it a second. Uh, if obviously that doesn't show up, you need to reinstall Python and click the add to path button. Uh, by adding it to path, you can run it from anywhere in the command line, which is uh, what you want to have happen. It makes life a lot easier. Um, so we're back into the command prompt uh, just at the, the location C. Now we're going to go to our browser and we are going to go to HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash bootstrap. dot pypa dot io forward slash git hyphen par pip pip dot py you want to right click and save that somewhere we're then going to come to the command prompt and we're going to um, change directory uh, to oh that's wrong uh, we want to go to the d drive basically so that's where i've saved it uh, on my d drive in desktop so I'm going to that location, uh, making sure I'm there, and then I can run the command that will install pip. So you just want to do uh, python space, and then you're going to type in git hyphen pip dot py, run it. It will install pip. If you've already got an older version of pip installed, it will actually uninstall it and install the newer version. Um, but this is only if pip isn't installed. Pip does come as standard in your Python installer, so you should have no reason why you haven't got it, but this is for you if you needed help. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. And if you want to check that it's installed and what version, just type in pip hyphen capital V, and that will be all good. It will tell you what version of pip you're running. Bye for now.